As the city of Edmonton has gone through a tremendous amount of growth over the last decade, the need for uh, infrastructure has grown considerably and every corner of the city has uh, deep tunnel construction going on, infrastructure renewal. This is driven purely by the fact the city of Edmonton is, is growing and growing and the need is out there for our crews to uh, keep the sanitary and storm systems flowing. The uh, city of Edmonton has a, uh, a large number of crews that perform tunneling operations from small diameter pipe all the way up to some fairly large tunnels. These tunnels are, are mostly for drainage, predominantly storm and sanitary uh, sewer lines for either rehab in some, some of the older neighborhoods or some of the large pipes are for new subdivision work. Some of the methods that we utilize are anywhere from the old style hand tunneling, which is basically jackhammers and shovels for some of our small pipes and small uh, road crossings and short projects, all the way up to some fairly large modern equipment uh, that we call our tunnel boring machines, also nicknamed our moles. It's fairly um, fairly rare that we actually dig up the complete road. We, we just localize it uh, at our main working shafts and tunnel in either an east, west or north, south direction. We have some uh, excellent workers that are expert in this type of construction and it's quite rare that a municipality has this expertise in-house. Occasionally we have been uh, called upon by other uh, smaller and larger municipalities to help them out with some of their deep tunneling work. Basically the benefit is lower taxes and less disruption to the neighborhoods and less disruption to traffic and there's uh, always a social cost that's hard to pinpoint on what the value is but when you're you're not closing roads down or impacting schools and shopping centers uh, we feel there's uh, there's very good uh, cost savings to the public. Our crews are very proud of the work they do. They are uh, extremely happy to come to work every day and, and they pride themselves in uh, having the expertise that they can do some of this work that nobody else locally is able to, to accomplish.